Basketball means a lot to me. When I first started playing basketball, it was like the age of three, and as soon as I touched the ball, I just loved it. I just wanted to play it. I wanted to play it for a living. Um, Carlisle Lewis, uh, known as Coach Slim. I've been training for uh, maybe over a decade now. You know, right now you're talking about a, a true sophomore. You know, super skilled. It's already six, seven. Probably got a couple more inches in him. You know, could do almost everything. Just got to start like kind of refining. So you know, he, he could be some kind of a pro. That doesn't stop. Never settle. <laughs> I gave it to him. I can't like this. I didn't even go. I take off a gym. I can't like this. Oh my god. Oh. I would have gave it to him. Yeah, it was 23. Some, some kid tried to dunk on me on the other end. And I blocked it. I said, Do you do it? No, it was a bit man. The 14, number 14. I don't know. One of them tried to duck it. Nah, but the big man, he, he was right there. Oh my God, I put my hand on him. It was like Blake Griffin. Oh my Jesus. <laughs> Bro, the, the kid go block the shot. Oh my God, I was really like Blake Griffin. My name is Malik Renu, class of 2022, and I'm from Matter Academy. Football means a lot to me. When I first started playing basketball, it was like the age of three, and as soon as I touched the ball, I just loved it. I just wanted to play it. I wanted to play it for a living. I wanted to play it. I don't know, I just, I just like playing the, the game of basketball. My mentality, once I step on the court, is to, to go at the person that I'm in, that's in front of me, to get them in foul trouble, because usually it's either their big man or it's one of the best players guarding me. So I got to get them in foul trouble, so I go at them every time. Nothing but net. Oh. oh! Sim, I don't know why I don't, I don't shoot him. I, I don't... I don't know. Go. Oh. You need that dribble. You know you, you know you dribble unnecessarily at times too, right? Who, me? You always try to go to that, that, that spin to where you put the ball. When you put it on the floor, no, just rise up and shoot. That's what I'm trying to tell you. You need to start getting that thing. Rise up and a nice, soft touch shot. Right here, in the yeah, middle? Right here. Right here. Yeah, you get rebound, I'm saying. You spin back, but you continue on. Like, you try to, ah, once you get in this area right here, man, fade away. Like, you have a nice shot within this area. So, what I'm saying, instead of it always having to be a power move, it could be a finesse move. Boom, I get it. I'm over the top, and I'm going right into the shot. Um, Carlisle Lewis, uh, known as Coach Slim. I've been training for uh, maybe over a decade now. I started working with him since he was in the third grade. Third grade, third grade. Yeah, we started off in the third grade. He was one of my high prospect kids. You know, lefty, goofy, same way he is now. But um, we started back working maybe this summer. You know, I reached out to him and told him, let's get in the gym. And then we start, you know, say, hitting off every every Saturday, Sunday from now. Where it turned into just Sundays only uh, as the season's going along because, of course, they have six days a week uh, worth of practice. Mentality change. I, I don't think Malik has tapped into his, like, his true potential yet. Like, and it's a mentality thing. It's not a skill with him. It's more so just understanding, like, how much more he can actually do, you know what I'm saying, to, to become even greater than what he's doing right now. Oh, I'm, I met Slim. He was my coach my third grade year for AAU. And I met Slim, and I was training with him before. 
And then he left. He went to um, go coach the um, Miami Country Day girls team. And I, he, I just hit him back up um, not too long ago, like in the summertime. And we started working out ever since then. I led up to Carmelo Anthony when he was on the Nuggets. Um, he, I played a similar game to him, like the face-up game. He just shoots more shots than me. I like to take it to the basket. But I'm going to start um, adding a shot to my game. They don't give me no bounce, no nothing. I at least made this one right here. Oh. Two for five. That's what I'm saying. That's an easy shot for you to warm up and shoot too, though. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like your warm up should look like that. You warm up, let's say you walk to it like. I don't think about the, like, I don't think or, like, I don't see, like, rankings. Like, I just play my game and the people watching understand, like, oh, he's pretty good. Like, yeah, he can play basketball and stuff like that. My goal is to be Mr. Basketball. And my ultimate goal is to win a state championship. We got a hard district this year and we got a hard regional. But uh, I feel confident about my team and us going out and, and playing hard like we always do. Shout out to Hoop Movement. <laughs> <laughs> A movement that doesn't stop, never settles.